Calling all units, be on the lookout for a purple male, approximately 55 feet tall with horns and a giant sword. Goes by the name of Void Reaver. He recently escaped from the hardcore hospital for the mentally insane and has reportedly been seen in the Iceville area. Unit 420, do you copy? Uh, copy that headquarters, just finished patrolling. Everything looks good and quiet over here. You know, Nico, I was wondering if you're not doing anything on Friday, if you'd want to... What in the world is that? Want to what, Unit 420? Uh, standby headquarters, something's going on over here. What in the heck is that? No, it can't be. It's here! It's here! I need backup! Want to what? Go on a date? Yes, I'd love to. I've always loved you. Oh man, that silly Void Reaver just out here destroying cop cars and eating enforcers. What's up guys, Harry's back with two cats and a Void Reaver. I promise this is the last dev abuse video I have footage of. I actually recorded this way back on the very first day that the hardcore update was officially released, which was October 30th, 2020. I was just going around, exploring the lobby like everybody else, and guess who I ran into? Jordan State and the Biscuit Turtle Creature himself. So I thought to myself, this is super sus. They gotta be up to something. So I followed them into a game, and the next thing I knew, bam, I had $10 million. I knew it! They were trying to do dev abuse without me. Don't these people know that I'm the king of abusing devs? Well, it's a good thing I'm here so I can observe their illegal acts. Wait. That's illegal. And I guess, you know, you gotta share the devs with some other content creators. It's only fair. Let me go ahead and give a shout out to Jordan State. Guys, drop him a sub and let him know how much you love cats. He's another great tower defense simulator YouTuber. Go ahead and check out his channel. I will put the link to that in the description below. Red alert, red alert. Void Reavers escaped the hardcore mental hospital. What are these cool blue explosions happening here? Is that normal? To be honest, I only played the hardcore game mode a couple of times to get the badge and then I bought the rest of my gyms because pay to win so i don't know if he just has blue explosions sometimes let me know down in the comments below what the heck is going on here hold up let me get a screeny real quick because this is the only time i'm ever gonna see the void reaver on this map rail guns attack oh he's spawning the rail gun tanks and not the 901s in this update the 901s became the mechs go ahead and spawn in some mechs man those are a lot cooler all right he's at half health which is when he throws his sword let's see what this looks like on a non hard core map. No way. He just stop destroyed all those tanks. Biscuit, I'm gonna need you to call in some more. Okay, that works. Whoa, the lag. And he's off. Sprinting around the first corner, the Void Reaver makes a break for the finish line, but not without an army of tanks rushing to meet him. But it wasn't enough to stop him yet. We need more tanks. What's this? Another challenger has entered the arena? Iceville is now officially a hardcore map. Come on, Tonk, save us. It's only wave 20 and we've already seen two Void Reavers. Half health sword throw, half health stomp. Here come the tanks again. And he's off. Sprinting towards the first turn, the Void Reaver makes for the base to bring an end to all mankind. With 100,000 health, the only thing that can stop him now is an army of tanks, but I just don't know if we're going to get that. Disquid is calling in the backup, but will it be enough? Here comes the cavalry. Oh no! He Thanos snapped our backup out of existence. What are we going to do now? There's no hope. We're dead. Whoa, what a finish. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Ladies and gentlemen... We got him. Just barely at the very end. Now he sits alone with his regrets, wishing he'd made other choices because he wasn't expecting to come up against Harry and friends. He thought this would be an easy win. Well, he was wrong. Ooh, now that that's over, we can have a nice easy game. Time to sit back and relax and grab a cat. Wait, Jackobot? Come on! If you guys don't know, Jackobot was the boss from the 2019 Halloween event. Fun fact, the map for that event was Nightmare Carnival, which is in the game right now. But it was changed from a single lane map to a dual lane map for its re-release. You know, it's kind of ironic with what's going on right now with TDS where we're seeing a Halloween boss on an ice map and the 2020 Halloween event is still in the game even though we're still waiting for the 2020 winter event. Isn't that ironic? <laughs> Well, hey, at least here we're going to be able to kill him and end the Halloween event so we don't have to listen to the music again and 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 again. <laughs> And he's dead. Speaking of winter event, it's the OG winter boss Krampus. 
making his third appearance in a Dev Abuse video. If you love the 1997 action sci-fi film Face Off starring Nicolas Cage and John Travolta, you're gonna love Krampus' special ability. Since we're fighting him on an ice map, does that mean we get the Frost Blaster for beating him? Mom, get the camera! He's doing the thing! He's taking his face off! Wow, Jordan, I didn't realize you had family in this game. It looks just like him. They're brothers! Alright, Biscuit, you know what to do. Call in the talks. Gargoyle Commander is the coolest commander skin besides Maid Commander. Changed my mind. No way! He summoned the rarest boss in the game, the Fallen King! This is unbelievable! We're actually getting to see the Fallen King right now. Thank you so much, Biscuit, for giving us a chance to see this once-in-a-lifetime boss. So amazing. Much wow. 195,000 health? That's insane, bro! Oh no! He went immune! The rarest ability no other boss in the game has. How are we gonna kill him now that he's immune? Guys, hurry! He came out of immunity for only a few seconds. We have to attack now! Talks attack! No way! No way! We beat him! We could only beat the Fallen King using admin commands. I've been waiting for this moment my entire life. I'm finally a TDS pro. I went on and played one more game with Biscuit and Jordan, and immediately I get $5,000. Okay, I place one accelerator and it's gone. You, a slime escaped the Halloween map. Kill it. <laughs> this would have been much cooler if I'd released this video before the Halloween event came out. Then you'd all be like, ooh, what is that? But now that the event's been out for five months, it's just kind of like, eh. Guys, I want you to get into the time machine called your memories and travel back to the first day the hardcore update was out and just pretend like this is all new. Whoa, slimes. Oh, wow, the accelerator. Nico DJ, no way. Look, it's a mech. I I mean, Mark. Three. It's a Mark Three. Ah, oh, yes. Fifteen thousand more dollars. Now I can retire. So we're on wave twenty-three, and now he gives us one hundred and fifty thousand. I had just enough to get some max accelerators, and it's gone. Gets one hundred and fifty k. Still farms. Next video. Five hundred twenty-eight Twitter mini gunners versus the Fallen King. It is now time for the greatest rap battle in the history of the world. Nico DJ versus regular DJ. <laughs> Oh look, it's another enemy from the 2019 Halloween event, Jax. What? No way! Another Fallen King, the rarest boss in the game. Void Reaver escaped the mental institution again and now he's invading the medieval times map. Somebody get the talks in here. He just Thanos snapped the Void Reaver out of existence. We sent him back to the hardcore mental hospital once and for all. <laughs> Railgun tanks go burr. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to smash that like button with your forehead, hit that subscribe button with your big toe, and turn on notifications however you can so you don't miss any of my amazing upcoming content. And while you're at it, go ahead and join my growing Discord community. You can do that at discord.gg slash just Harrison things. And I will see you guys next time. Take care, be safe, and never forget what I always say. Peace!